One of the first places that people turn to when their hair starts thinning is hair toppers for thinning hair. And today I am so excited to be bringing you one of the newest hair toppers for thinning hair, part of the John Renault Favorites Collection, the Top Smart Wavy Synthetic Hair Topper, 18 inches in color toffee truffle. Wiggy Woman. I have been dealing with hair loss for a number of years and one of the first stops on my hair loss journey were hair toppers because they provide great coverage here at the part and the top of my head where I experience the most obvious thinning. Today I'm so excited to have a synthetic 18 inch hair topper by John Renault and I know what you're thinking. 18 inches my hair is maybe 10 inches long. So how is it that I am going to be wearing this 18 inch hair topper? And while we commonly think of hair toppers for thinning hair, hair toppers can also be a great way to add length and volume when covering hair loss. But before we get too far into it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell so that you never miss a wig or hair topper review or tutorial like this one that's posted weekly. The Top Smart Hair Topper is not necessarily new, but as part of John Renault's 2021 Favorites Collection, they expanded to include a wavy style. And today we're going to be looking at that in Toffee Truffle, which is one of the fashion syrup colors. This is a full featured hair topper. So it includes a lace front so that you can wear this topper right up to your hairline. It has six clips that are strategically placed throughout the entire topper, including three removable front clips. If you don't want pulling or extra tension on your hair, you can remove those clips and use adhesives instead. The clips are all the way around the topper, so it includes three on the back as well. And all of the lace is going to allow it to lay flat around the hairline for a seamless look. And you will be able to part this in any direction. So if you prefer a side part or a center part, you're going to have that flexibility. And then it also has these beautiful wavy curls that can be incorporated with your own natural hair. It's kind of like a beautiful loose beachy wave, kind of like... um. It's almost like a curl, depending on how you style it. So I was so excited when I saw that the John Renault Favorites collection included a wavy version of the Top Smart. If you have seen some of my other topper reviews, you'll know that the Top Smart is one of my favorite hair toppers for thinning hair because it has a lace front. And for me, most of my thinning is here at the top, but I also have a lot of gray. So it's very difficult for me to blend without using some kind of, you know, a root touch-up spray or something like that on a daily basis. So these lace front hair toppers are really great because they provide a whole new hairline. So I don't have to worry about covering up these pesky grays anymore. So let's dive in to the Top Smart 18 inch wavy synthetic topper in color Toffee Truffle. This is my first time seeing this too. I'm going to be sharing in this with you as well. You'll see this is still totally in the box. So uh, as you see it first, I'll be seeing it first too. And I am going to give you my true and honest thoughts about this hair topper by John Renault. Okay, so step one, I am literally going to take it out of the box. So this is the moment of truth. As with most John Renault products, it comes with a little care card. And um, then we have the topper and it's still in its packaging. So I'm just taking it out so you can see from start to finish exactly how I achieve my look. So here she is. I totally forgot about that hairnet, which, um, you know, kind of helps keep those fibers protected in shipping but I really wanted you to be able to see, you know, right out of the packaging exactly what this topper is going to look like. So here it is um, before I've combed it or done anything to it so you can get a feel for these curls. And you'll notice that they are very, very relaxed right out of the box. They're never gonna be tighter than the curls that you see here. And of course, there is that zigzag part that we all know and love when we receive a new hair product. But I wanna show her to you looking her best. So I'm going to hit it with some John Renault HD Smooth Detangler. And I'm going to grab my wide tooth comb and I'm going to um, go ahead and comb these fibers out because I want to kind of show you what this is going to look like on a day-to-day -day basis and break up those curls just a little bit. I'm also going to give it a good shake so that I can separate those fibers. 
I'm not going to totally detangle it yet, but I do want to set this part so that I can show you what this part line looks like before I put it on. As I hold it up to my light here, you can see totally through that part line all the way to my backdrop. So I'm hopeful this is going to give us a really nice scalp effect. Here you can see those three removable front clips and they do have a non-slip material behind them as well as those um, back three clips which help keep the topper secure without the use of a halo wire. And lastly, this is a close-up of that highlight pattern here at the part so you can see these beautiful chunky highlights. And now it's time to put her on. I'm going to speed this up here a little bit, but if you want to see in more detail how I do these lace front toppers, I do have a video specifically on how to install a lace front topper. So I am going through, I'm clipping all of the clips in one by one, and then I am actually going back to make sure that everything is even and adjusting as necessary. The nice thing about these wefted toppers is that you do get a little bit of stretch for a perfect fit. So here it is, your first look at the top smart wavy synthetic topper. I am like floored by how good this looks straight out of the box. One thing that I did notice is that these fibers were a little bit tangly after putting this on and kind of manipulating a little bit. So I definitely wanted to give it a good combing through. I did already spray this with the HD Smooth Synthetic Detangler and I am using my wide tooth comb to gently comb through these waves. So I start at the bottom and I detangle everything before I move my way up because I don't want to stretch out these fibers any more than I have to, especially relaxing some of that wave. So this did take me a while to really set that part where I wanted it. And um, I'm going to fast forward it a little bit and speed this up because I want to show you the effect of it without all of the time that it took to comb it. You'll see I did get a little bit of shedding, which I feel like is kind of par for the course when you have a long synthetic, especially a wavy hair topper like this one. All that combing and detangling, it really paid off though because it really helps to show off the beauty of this hair topper. It has just the right amount of glam. Okay, so the first thing that I realized, and this is very common with all long synthetics, is that this synthetic hair does tangle pretty easily. You saw it took me quite a bit to comb out all of these fibers, and this is a pretty high density topper, which is why I got it, because I do have, you can see somewhere back here, um, you can see my hair is significantly shorter than the topper. But when the topper is down, you really can't see that because it's so full coverage and it has a lot of density. So it's going to really hide all of that. And my hair color is just going to blend right in with these fibers. I have a really bright light on right now. And um, I am shocked at the lack of synthetic shine. Normally, that is one of the telltale signs of a synthetic hair piece is that it will shine like a light. And this one, however, I mean, it looks it looks really good. It looks like normal, healthy human hair. And I think that could be why it tangles maybe a little bit more easily because it's not overly processed with those silicones and things that a lot of synthetic hair has. It has a very, very realistic um, look to it, but it also has a very realistic feel to it. I mean, it feels like human hair, which is really interesting because it is a synthetic. So. Um, like I can, once I get it all combed out, I can rub my fingers through it and it doesn't feel like plastic. You know, it really has kind of a hair fiber feeling to it. And you'll see these fibers are thin, but they're not too thin. They really have like a natural dendron to them that kind of reminds me of my own hair before it started thinning. All right, so I'm gonna fluff it out get a feel for what it would look like on a regular basis. And then I'm going to turn it around and show you this piece in 360 degrees. All right. So first let's check out this part line. Very natural, like very good. Normally I would be adding concealer and things to a, um, a topper or a wig. But, you know, I, I kind of tried to line it up where my own part was so that what you're seeing underneath is, in fact, scalp. And uh, it's doing a really good job. Like, I wouldn't need to actually 
add concealer or anything to this because I feel like it has a really nice look to it. I see now why they call it wavy and not curly because it really isn't like an intact curl. It kind of reminds me more of like um, Heidi or Rachel in the wig series where it's just this kind of really relaxed. It has like a natural movement to it, but it's not like curly, you know? So I really like it. I think it has a really nice, um, you know, kind of in between a straight and a curly piece. It's got a really nice look to it, kind of like how normal healthy hair would look if it was naturally dried. So I'm going to turn around and show you all sides of this John Renault Top Smart 18 inch synthetic hair topper wavy from the John Renault Favorites collection. And as I'm doing that, pay attention to my hair, which is considerably shorter than this topper and get a feel for how much coverage this topper has. John Renault Top Smart 18 inch in synthetic hair and wavy. And you'll see here that the color code is 63027 Toffee Truffle. And I'll put those details also in the description. So Toffee Truffle has, you know, a base of six, which is a medium to dark brown, but it has these much lighter, chunky highlights, which I really like because again, my hair underneath is not highlighted. It has no dimension to it and a lot of it is gray. So um, by having this hair topper, it covers my thinning hair, but it also kind of gives me permanent highlights without having to go to a salon, which I love. But I love it. I love it. I love it. The lace is pre-cut. I don't know if you saw that. I didn't have to cut this lace at all. I just took it out of the package and put it on and it created this really, really nice, um, this really, really nice hairline without me having to do anything to it. And I think that's a huge convenience factor because you know, it's going to look right, right out of the box. So yeah, this is the top smart from the John Renault favorites collection. Gonna be one of my newest favorite hair toppers for my thinning hair. Um, not only just for my thinning hair, but as you can see, this covers my length beautifully. I mean, you would never know that my actual bio hair is only like 10 inches long. So this totally satisfies my need for long hair, but without a lot of the things that you would find in a wig, like having to have a full cap and, um, you know, being able to do low ponies and things like that. So I have a lot more styling versatility. It's a lot more comfortable to wear than an 18 inch wig. Uh, and it looks really great and totally covers up my short hair. I guess if I had to find a con in this piece, it would be that taking it out of the package, it was a little bit challenging to comb it all through, but I think that that's kind of just par for the course when you have long synthetics. I have that same problem with long synthetic wigs as well. But, um, you know, once I got it combed out, it stayed pretty well combed out. I don't think it's been um, tangling up too much as I've been flipping it around, putting it on, putting it in ponytails and all kinds of stuff like that. So um, you will want to carry a wide tooth comb with you in your purse throughout the day just to refreshen it because long synthetic styles are more prone to tangling. But all in all, this is going to be really easy to wear. Like I'm really, I'm really, really excited about this. So I did put a link to this very hair topper in the description. It is a new style for 2021, part of the John Renault Favorites collection that just came out. Um, this just shipped this week. So if you wanna know where to get it, you can check out the description below, as well as I put a lot of links to my favorite synthetic hair care products. Thanks so much for joining me on my first look at the John Renault Top Smart Synthetic Wavy Hair Topper from the John Renault Favorites collection. 
If you enjoyed this video, please, please, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell so that you never miss a wig or hair topper review or tutorial that's posted weekly. Thank you so much for joining me today and I will see you next week.